right, Josh. So, mate, first experience at Bankwest Stadium. How was that? Probably don't see much of that out where you're from. It's pretty hectic, to be <laughs> honest. Yeah, and um, but it's a it's a good professional environment. Where uh, whereabouts are you from? Let's start with that. I was born in Brisbane, but um, I was raised in Down all my life. So, so Down's my home. Down's your home. Yeah. Now, obviously, I mean, pretty big opportunity to come down to Sydney as a part of the Dream Big Time Tour. How important is that? to a bloke like yourself? Well, I'm getting older now and um, I see this as an opportunity to change my life for my family's sake. And I've got a little girl and um, I'm doing it for them. Also for myself, but mainly for them. And your, your pathway to this point, I understand, it probably hasn't been as, as easy or as straightforward as a lot of other people's pathway. Do you want to give us a bit of an insight into that maybe? Well, this is really the first time that I've ever wanted to change my life. And, um, yeah, I'm giving it a crack. For, for the first time in my life, I'm, um, I'm actually going to try and do it the right way. When you say the right way, uh, I mean, it's, it's, it's easy to take the wrong way so often. But in what way were you perhaps taking the easy route or well, going wrong? Taking the bad way in life, to me, is... Um, ended up incarcerated and in prison. And um, I don't want to live like that anymore. So, yeah, I'm on the road to change. And this opportunity is something that's big to me and I'm going to give it my all. How is rugby and being in this environment and playing with your brothers and things like that, how is that helping you see the person that you perhaps want to become? Well, it's positive. And, um, this is probably the first opportunity that I've really had in my life. And so I'm not here for a holiday, I'm here to, um, you know, hopefully to, to join the squad. But coming from up there, we don't really, you know, a lot of the people or, or my friends and that, that I've grew up with, we, yeah, we just don't get, get, get as much opportunities as, um, as they do in the big smoke, in the big cities. Being the way that should have been passed and come out here and really put your best foot forward. It sounds like the kind of bloke that should really be getting around some of the youngsters and stuff in the camp. Have, have you managed to chat to some of the younger guys and be a bit of a mentor? Well, there's somebody here that's with me from Alice Springs. His name is Rowan Armstrong, and um, I've probably been around Rowan for about five to six months, and um, I've took him under my wing, and I've tried to, to, to tell him and teach him that the reason that we're here today is because we, we push for this. You know, we train every day, we um, push our bodies to the limit, and you know, I can't take everybody on, you know, and, and I can't tell them about the good life. All I can tell them is about my experiences and, and, and turning the bad way in life, which is, you know, which is going to prison. Being where we are isn't the right way. We try to remain positive as much as we can and, um, yeah.